Hey guys, welcome back. You're still watching Midcap Radar on CNBC TV 18. For the market right now, it's in around 1% cut, 1.2% lower on the index that we're seeing right now. So we have seen a little bit more of a move downwards in the past couple of minutes. The Nifty Bank also has slipped a little bit more. It's currently down around 240 points. So it's a good time to get you a technical check on this market. Manish Hathiramani of Deen Dayal Investments joins us now for a quick uh, check on the market. Uh, Manish, good afternoon and thanks a lot for joining us. So considering how it has panned out, you know, we saw a significant recovery from the day's low. We've seen a little bit of a slip back now. How would you approach the market right now? Good afternoon, Reema and Pavitra. Thank you so much for having me on the show. Well, we have gone sideways after the downfall and the up move and now again a downfall today. The range is really between 17,100 to 17,800. The larger medium to long term uh, charts continue to look positive. We are not seeing any sense of nervousness in the short term. And unless 17,100 holds, we continue to be a buy on dips approach. Okay, buy on dips. What's the dip that you would buy the Nifty ad and your individual trading ideas? So, well, I would be looking at any kind of a drop all the way till 17,100. It's only alarming if 17,100 was to close on a closing basis. All right. And uh, what about any individual trades that you would take right now? Any recommendations? Well, from the mid-cap segment, I'm looking at two buy calls on Canera Bank and Apollo Tires. Canera is a buy for a target of 265, stop loss of 225. Between 210 to 230, the volumes have been inclining with price, which is a good sign. 235 was also a zone of resistance, but we have comfortably flown out of that which makes the stock a good buy and an accumulation candidate for higher targets. Apollo Tires is a buy for a target of 280, stop loss of 225. The support of 235 to 240 was respected and we have turned up thereafter. The volumes are encouraging too. The stock looks good even from a medium term investment perspective. Okay, we leave it to that. Thank you very much for joining in. Eurozone August PMI uh, for manufacturing has slipped a bit in the month of August, 49.6 versus 49.7. Uh, let's move on to our mid-cap mover segment. Mangalam is standing by the big wall to tell us about the mid-caps which are active in trade. Mangalam. Well, there are a lot of stocks which are active and how in trade. We start with Tata 